Hello, everyone. Joining me from Western Kenya is Guido Kibukosia. He is a longtime producer, a musician, and he has a special relationship to this music video. How are you doing, Guido? Oh, very well, thank you, Hitler. Great. So this music video was released in January 2021. It is by the artist Freshly Mwamburi. It already has over 2 million views on YouTube. So Guido, what is your relationship to this song? I tell you what, is it? Freshly has always been a very good musician. So uh, he was on uh, KBC radio. And I had him, and being a producer, I told him, listen, for this uh, video to get more views, I think we, he should redo it because the style is old. So let's try and make it a bit more modern. And that is why I think it's really picked up. Yeah, reggae is quite a, a big hit around here in, uh, in Kenya. When was the original song released? I think it was released in uh, 1993, if I'm not wrong. Okay. Can you summarize the story? Okay, the story is this. He, he's got a, a girlfriend and she got a scholarship. He sold his car, he sold so many other things just to get her to Japan. So when she got to Japan, she fell in love with somebody else. So when she comes back, he's going to meet her at the airport. She's with somebody else and with a baby. <laughs> what is he singing? Is he just telling the story or is he giving a message warning people? You no, know, he's just telling a story. He's like, this is what happened to me, man. You guys, you know, it's just so everybody's like, oh, poor guy. <laughs> so what happened to Stella? <laughs> Part of the YouTube comments that I was reading that gave me the indication that this was such a big comeback, they were referring a lot to him as a legend. What makes him a legend, Freshly Mumbori? He's been there for a while. He's uh, really played alongside um, groups like uh, Simba Onyeko is a very big group. He's only one of the members that is remaining. All the others passed away, but he's still around. I see. Another comment that I read said, I was looking for the Kenyan national anthem, and this is what I found. What does that mean? I don't know. You know, my dad wrote the Kenyan national anthem. <laughs> yeah. Well, it is a great song. I love it. It does have a good beat. You've done a great job with the remix. Yeah, I just try to make it uh, appeal to the youth and uh, I mean to the rest of the world. Yeah, it's fantastic. Well, thank you so much for joining me, Guido. Thank you so much, Heather. And I hope we'll be in touch more often and share. I do too.